Herkese merhaba değerli arkadaşlar. Aksiyon dolu oyunumuz devam ediyor. Videosu da gördüğünüz gibi burada. Ee, zaten kısa bir videoymuş. O da bir şey değil yani. Şunu basalım. Şuradan bir şey ayarlamam gerekiyor. Monitöre bakmıyorum şu an ama. E buradan baktığım e, bir şey var. E, şöyle... My father was a musician in Stalingrad. During the German occupation. Şuradaki hatayı bir düzeltmem lazım. O yüzden böyle yamuk duruyorum. Kusura bakmayın değerli arkadaşlar. Korsikov, Stasov, many of the great nationalist composers. To my countrymen, it was a symbol of hope. To the Germans, it was a symbol of defiance. Even now, his music still haunts me. Güzel. Ayarlarımızı yaptık. Çatılardan atlıyoruz. Aşağı düşüyoruz. Abi nedir bu Dragovic'ten çektiğim ya? Adam hayatımın zulmü oldu resmen. Abi burada ne işimiz var? Gıçımız donar burada ya. Veins chills when I think back to the events of that day. Ah, the hero of Berlin graces us with his presence. Have you not tired of battle risen? As long as Mother Russia has enemies, I will answer her call. Put aside your petty rivalry, Kravchenko. Captain Reznov will do as he is told. Ne giyersen giy bu soğuk adamın götü donar ya. One German and one German only. Dr. Friedrich Steiner. This man has offered his cooperation to our cause. He is not to be harmed. Disobey this order. And you will be shot. What happened in Stalingrad between you and Dragovich? When the German occupation began, he and his laptop, Trachenko, left my men and I hopelessly outnumbered. Promises of reinforcements were made. Made, but not kept. Dragovich and Trachenko are opportunists, manipulators. They are not to be trusted, Dmitry. Dmitry Trachenko was one of the bravest men I have ever known. <laughs> Aa, mikrofon öfledim ya. From the siege of Stalingrad to the fall of Berlin. The wounds he has sustained. Emmim anlatıyor. Ensuring our victory should have earned him a hero's welcome to Russia. But Stalin had little need for heroes. The German must not be harmed. We need Steiner alive. Now move, both of you. Let's go. Oğlum adam adı Dragovich lan. Yes, my friend. One final dip. Search every corner of this camp. Only stand to be spared. Hurra!
Ben sıkıyorum, ben de sana sıkarım. Ben de sıkıyorum, bak benim de mermim var. Dangalaklar. Ben tek teslim teslim almıyorum. Geleni geçeni vuruyorum ben. Ben öldürüyorum abi. Ölüm makinesine hoş geldiniz. Diz size ölüm makinesi. Hızına sıçtığım geber. Teslim olmanız umurumda bile değil. Ölün. Sen de geber, sen de geber. Saklan. Çık. Vur bunu, bunu da vur. Hepsini vur, geber hepsini. Ne güzel oluyorsunuz lan. Ölün lan. Aha geri zekalı. Bize mi atacaksın? Al. Bu silah çok kötü ya. <gülüyor> Ölür müsün? İyi de ben buradan nereden çıkacağım abi? Mortar Strike ne ya? Hadi. After this mission, do you think we will go home? I hope so, Dimitri. I hope so.
This way. Up the stairs. Kaçtı mı lan benden? Göç. Kimin kimi öldürdüğü belli değil. Nereye geldim lan ben? Russian dog. Bana Rus köpeği mi dedin sen? You will take me to Dragovich. As I looked into the German's eyes, I saw Ne oldu lan? Git bölümü mü geçtim ben? Dayı anlatıyorsun ama. Every fiber of my being yearned to put an end to his wretched life. But I was a soldier then. I still believed in orders. Reznov, bring your men. What is here that is so important? General Dragovich wishes to make a name for himself. He believes this outpost houses something of great value to the motherland. Dragovich and Steiner are talking like old friends. I do not like this, Reznov. No, I do not. We must hurry! On your guard. There are Germans who would sooner see you destroyed than captured. You assured me there would be no problems. I cannot control the actions of the SS, General Dragovich. They are sworn to defend the Reich till their last breath. Noble, but futile. Gravchenko! Finish up here. Reznov, you and your men will lead the way. Yes, sir. Petrenko, Vikarev, Nevsky, Dolov. We are moving out. Steiner, tell me more about your association with the Gift Eager Storm Project. In 43, the Fuhrer realized the Allies could not be held back for much longer. We begin to look for more. Unconventional solutions. Dana dana. Throughout the war, my own research was focused on chemical weapons. It was meticulous and frustrating work. However, what we finally developed was a weapon more effective than we had ever dared to imagine. The weapon now housed within this vessel. Nova Six. Hmm. affected the Nervo 6 chemical may be, you still had to find a way to unleash it. Long-range V2 rockets to be launched from this outpost. The targets were command and control centers. Washington DC was our first target. Then Moscow. Hmm. Ambitious and commendable, Herr Steiner. But we were too late. The British were upon us and their bombers crippled the ship. Locked in the ice, we tried to salvage what we could. But it was too late. Germany had surrendered, and a Russian flag flew over Berlin. The SS had orders to destroy the ship if we were attacked. Clearly, <laughs> they failed. The explosives were never activated. This is it. Brezhnev, action that they are. Şimdi dayıya döneceğiz, dayı anlatacak. We were looking for Nova 6. The German weapon of mass disruption now belong to Mother Russia. Or so it seemed. Our victory was to be short-lived. Dragovich wanted to see the effects of the poison firsthand. Dragovich 
It was a betrayal. I should have foreseen. The military and tranquil was a hero. He deserved the hero's death. Instead of giving his life for the glory of the motherland, he died for nothing. Like an animal. He should have died in Berlin. Asit mi döküyor? Ne döküyor bu psikopat lan? As I watched my closest friend die, it became clear we were not the only ones seeking the German weapons. Bence bize de aynısını yapıyor, yapacaktı. Of course, Dragovich, Kroshenko and Steiner scattered like rats, leaving me to contend with the British. British commandos assaulting our positions! Rus para sık, Rus para. Bu nasıl sıçtığımın? Çocuğu. Ölün geberin lan itolitler. Ananı avradını Koşun lan. Lan oğlum. Ağzına sıçam koş koş koş koş koş. 
he would die before he gives up on Nova Six. Ne oldu lan? Hikayenin bu bölümünü de anlattık. Şimdi kalan kısma. Listen to me. We have run out of time, my friend. Abi biz nasıl bir mekandayız? Nasıl bir poktan yerdeyiz? Yani küçükken bebeleri korkutan dede gibi davranıyorsun be emmi be. Allah ne diyeyim saçlarım hep dağıldı. Ebenoski. Babanoski. Çekilik lan önümden. Hudson's mission at Kowloon was accomplished. He had discovered Dragovich's endgame, Nova 6. The nerf toxin so deadly that if exposed, you'd be dead before you hit the floor. Dragovich's weapon. Go back to Vietnam, Mason. Was Victor Reznov still with you after you escaped from the Vacky compound? <sighs> Reznov was with me the whole time. Are you sure? North. We went north. Sanırım bir sonraki aşamaya geçtik şu an. <gülüyor> shut down. Reznov even survived that. Dragovich's laptop Krepchenko was there. He knew we were coming. Ne oluyor? Aldım ne oluyor? Evet. This is Hotel 91. We are going down in Sector Bravo, Tango 79er. Mayday, mayday. Bir şeyler havaya uçtu. Evet. Neredeyim lan? David, still with me? Come on, David, talk to me. Frank, you okay? Shit. My leg. Okay, I'm wrong. bleeding. I need some help here. I think you're gone. <sighs> Stay. You're coming. Kill <laughs> those bastards. We gotta get out of here. This is much. We're going under, man. Angamın suratını ya dağıttım lan. Evet herkese tekrardan merhaba diyeceğiz bir sonraki bölümde değerli arkadaşlar. Yani Vietnam'a geçtik çünkü hikayenin yeri değişti. Videoyu beğendiyseniz lütfen beğen butonuna basmayı unutmayın değerli arkadaşlar. Abone olarak kanalımıza destek olabilirsiniz. Yorum yazmayı lütfen esirgemeyin. Kendinize çok çok çok iyi bakın değerli arkadaşlar. Yeni videoda yeni oyunda tekrar görüşünceye kadar şimdilik cümleten Allah'a emanet.